Howdy, 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 y'all, and welcome to a game called Bug Out that Mitzi requested that we check it out for our weekend first looks. It came out back in 2018, but I had never heard of it, so I haven't played it, so we're going to do first looks, first impressions, all that. So we got Welcome to Bug Out Backstory. Over the past few million years, people around the world have been preparing for a world disaster. No one really knows what happens, but many will have their own opinions. While well, most believe that it will be nuclear war, the events range from meteorites and pole shifts to global warming and economic collapse. Some believe all these events will ha will happen in something known as apocal as the apocalypse. Oh, I can't speak again. Even the government has been hoarding food and supplies in deep underground bunkers. Most of us just thought the preppers were crazy and that the government was just doing their job and preparing for anything that could happen. People started to notice that the government and elites of the world were st starting to move groups of people into the bunkers and state <clears throat> and state by state they were passing laws stopping all sales of firearms, hunting gear, and about all survival supplies. As fear started to set in, some people decided it is time to move to a safer location. But not people like us. We thought this is a great government of ours, would be there for us if anything happened, so we went along with the program. <clears throat> in 2019, everything started to change. The biggest change was the weather. We never seen a winter in 2018-19. to 19. It felt like summer for the last 18 months, and on top of that, it stopped raining about four months ago. With all the heat and no rain, water supplies are running low, and food production has slowed. Restrictions were put on water, and riots started breaking out. The government started bringing in the military to control the crowds. As the problem got worse, they started to block in the cities and made announcements that in, order to, that in order to ration the food and water for everyone, they were going to implement a new tracking system. Everyone was to report to the local FEMC for a tracking device implant. Without it, they would not be able to receive food and water rations. It was at this time you realized that you need to do something, or you may not make it very long. With just the clothes on your back and an empty backpack, you head out of the city into the mountains to try and survive. You find an old dirt road leading off into the hills. You start your journey as you walk along the dirt road. You wonder, could this be the apocalypses? Am I going crazy? You also stress the thought of trying to survive in the mountains. You've never done anything like this, but it can be, can't be any worse than what is happening in the cities. You see a wood sign ahead. You stop to see what it says. Welcome to Bug Out. <laughs> meet Ron. You're going to need help to survive in these mountains. Find the trade shop and meet the trader Ron. Activate. Activate. Okay, so it's tab. Okay, tab is like, do we have these things already? Or are these things we got to make? Uh, I think we probably need to craft them, right? Oh, no, we have them. So we have an axe. Okay, so can I go into first person? I'm not a big fan of third person. C? No, that's crouch. V? No. Okay, well, we'll figure it out. Oh, I'm hitting E. Okay, so can we chop trees? We can. Okay. Like I said, I haven't played this game at all. I hadn't even heard of it until Missy asked me today to showcase it this weekend. So, as you guys know, the top, like, she's one of my biggest supporters on the channel. So, usually she wants me to showcase something, then we definitely must do it. Especially if she's helping with providing the game. Okay, so we got large logs, which I'm assuming we can't pick many. Oh, we can. Okay, is I our inventory? It is. Okay, so we have two MREs. Three bandages. Let's go ahead and put the bandages down on nine. And we got three large logs. So we got our character here. We can get some clothing made, it looks like. Health, energy, stamina, hunger, and thirst. We got basic crafting. We got fiber, rope, basic campfire, fire tender, woodworking area, slingshot, ammo, and tie down pegs. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. How do I get? Oh, there we go. So we got task, which is meet trader Ron. Uh, do we need to like click it on? I think it's already on. And we got our map right here. Oh, ooh. Love when games give us a map. We got our survival handbook. Find a place to build a homestead, build a woodworking station, build a storage building, build a house and workstations, gather a store, and prepare for anything that could happen. And we got button. I don't know what button is, but we have all these things. Okay, so let's escape. No? Uh all right, just move and it will go away. So let's see if we can't find Ron. I'm assuming he's going to be down yonder. Since it put us right here, uh, let's go ahead and grab that branch. I'm going to assume stones and branches are going to be like muy importante. Oh, is that Ron just kicking it, chilling? Are you Ron? Pops, Trader Ron is right inside. Thanks, Pops. Hello, my name is Ron. I am the owner of the campground and store. Nice to meet you. You have competed, you have completed task, meet Ron, not competed, I think it's a typo. I guess you have decided to flee the city and take your chances in the mountains like everyone else. It's not easy to survive here, you're going to need some help. 
It's like you have some tools and weapons. Ammo, as you know, is very rare. So if you treat it like gold, as far as your other gear, it doesn't look like you'll have much to survive on. I can round you up some gear, but it'll take me a bit. While I look for some stuff, you should go around the campground loop. Go around the campground loop and meet some of the people that live here. They all have skills they can offer to help to get you started. Maybe you can barter with them for things you will need. Go around to meet the resident campers while I gather some gear for you. Activate. Come back and see me when you get done. Maybe I have a few things. Next. Okay, so let's go meet some campers. I really, I don't like the bobble. I don't like games that have like this bob when they walk. It drives me absolutely crazy and it makes my head hurt. Like, it's like my eyes start floating when there's a bob with the walk. And I already looked and I don't see a way to turn it off, so. Uh, let's go over here. There's no music in the game yet. They are um, about to launch. It's in a few more days till a huge update comes out where they're going to actually introduce a female character and such. So, uh, anything over here? Can we have that? I mean, I already have one, but why not? Oh, oh, we got a box of nails and a some slingshot ammo. Take it all. Is it two separate ones? A box of nails and small jar. Nuts and bolts and scrap metal pile. Oh, there's looting. I didn't even realize there was looting. You guys know how much that makes me happy. Oh, we have an herb pouch for seeds. We're already getting pretty full pretty quickly. We're going to have to like, be very careful on what we take. Nothing there. Nothing in there. Anytime games bop and wobble like this, I have the damn wobble song stuck in my head like the end. Can I have that sludgy? No, why, why is it floating? Wrangler, get down. Sorry, my dogs are in the window trying to get the cat that's outside the window. Oh. <clears throat> That cat is very, very brave cat because it will sit in the window where the, our window has to stay open for the AC to be able to uh, slingshot ammo nuts and bolts to be able to breathe. And uh, <laughs> it will sit in there and terrorize the dogs. We have three big, huge, like 50 to 100 pound dogs and it will sit there and terrorize them. Like Either you're a really dumb cat or you are a very, very smart cat with a big old set of cojones. I think it's the latter of the two. What do we have here? Anything we can... Nothing here? Okay. So let's wait nuts and bolts and plate glass so quite a few different things to craft with oh I see more trash bags I see the goodies oh that's not lootable that's not lootable okay these are not lootable probably because they're Ron's trash we probably shouldn't mess with Ron's trash being that he's gonna help us uh, so we have to take the campground loop so let's go down here and see what that house is up there on the left and then we'll see what all stuff we can craft up See if we can't find us at location. I'm going to do like three episodes of this, see what you guys think, and then we'll take it from there. But, you know, we spend the weekends doing our first looks now. I started that on the 1st of May. That Monday through Friday is for content we already have started. Saturday and Sunday, or Monday through Thursday. Saturday and Sunday is for loot. Loot? No. <laughs> for first looks to see what you guys want to start up. If we want to end a series and start something new. Hello, I'm Elizabeth. You just completed task. Meet Elizabeth. Come back and see me after you talk to Ron. Okay, Elizabeth, you need some stuff in your house, though. It's looking a little barren in there. I mean, we could always hook up then, you know. I scratch your back, you scratch mine. Do I have to go back and talk to Ron now? Or can that be like, do I have to go meet other people first? Let's look. Uh, no, no, I wanted tasks. Oh, so we met Pops already, but I think we need to go meet him again. Jason, Eric, Janice. Okay. another house over here. I mean, the game is pretty. I mean, yeah, it needs a little bit more work and all, but it's still early access, so. And according to the Steam page, look, the developers are really trying to update and get things moving and grooving. Anything here? Nothing in there. Oh, looks like nighttime is upon us. I wonder if we can make a torch. Who is you? Oh, trade. Vendor. Well, I don't really have anything to trade. Or the trading's just not working. I don't know. I mean, I have basic supplies. I don't have anything made. Refill canteen. We don't have a canteen. How do we make a canteen or do we have to find that? Hmm. So to make the woodworking area, we need six large logs, four ropes, four branches, and a hand planter. I don't think planter is what it meant to say. Uh, how do we make these things, or do we have to just find them? How do we make rope? Because we have three large logs so far. So rope is 25 fiber. We'll 
we'll have to see how to make the fibers. Oh, it is super dark. Do we have a torch? Uh, what is this? Oh, it's our slingshot. Oh, we found slingshot ammo earlier, didn't we? Uh, box of nails, small jar, slingshot ammo. Uh, use. I'm learning. Okay, we got our gun, our bow, our knippy, and a machete. Uh, I'm not entirely sure. Looks like we can find a pistol. I'd like to have a torch. It's super, super dark. Maybe the night cycle's super fast. Yeah, we definitely needs a torch. Uh, some more slingshot ammo. Scrap metal and more slingshot ammo, which is just rock, so. Hello, I'm Eric. Nice to meet you. You just completed a task. Meet Eric. It's nice to see a new face around here. Come back and see me after you get some experience, and I'll teach you a few things. Good luck and nice meeting you. Well, hello, Eric. Nice meeting you, too. Um, do you have a torch I can borrow, Eric? Because it is super dark. I'll probably see if I can cut out the uh, insane darkness because this is like I can't see anything so pretty sure y'all can't either I can try and light it up when I upload it but it might just be easier just to cut out the crazy dark wandering the world um, I saw something ahead is that that same sign? yes wait I think it's just a different wait is that the same sign? F nothing happens uh, let's go ahead and look at our map real quick. Hoping this will fill in as we go around or something. I don't know. It's a very basic map. Um, I... No. Get off my screen. Things to do. Alright, there we go. Yeah, I would really love a first person. It doesn't feel so wobbly or bobby if you can do it in first person. To me, at least. I need the sun to come up right now. It is really dark and I can't see squat. I don't think we're going the right way. I think we're supposed to go the other way. But he did call it a loop, so... Is that a train or is that just trees? I can't tell. Yeah, I need to watch the video again on how to, like, cut things out of your videos. I don't plan on doing it very much, so if you want like the super crazy cuts and edits, then that's not something I'm going to be doing here. I just do the grind before I record an episode, but usually first episodes always are exactly as the game plays out. Oh, it's a bunny! Hello, Thumper! Oh, F. I don't know. Oh, 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 plant fiber. Is our inventory full? It shouldn't be. Just because I don't know. Can we drop this? Drop. Yes. I'm not sure if our inventory is full or not, so. And I did just see something that said plant fiber, didn't it? Maybe we have to. Oh! Right click, like. Okay, I can't see anything, so I'm not going to worry about it right now. Oh, pine branches. can use and drop. We got sticks. Hmm. I haven't seen plant fiber yet, but it's probably <clears throat> like out in off the beaten path. Something we have to like Oh, that's probably another branch. Something we have to um oh, we just circle completely around, didn't we? That's okay, we can go say hi to Pop since he's just chilling here. What is this? Oh, I thought it was a dead animal for a minute. I'm Pops, nice to meet you. You have just completed a task? Pe meet Pops. How's it going? What can I help you with? Sometime I just might need something. Okay, so we needed to re-meet him anyway because we didn't get him when we first said hi. Let's go. It's like, I don't know if it's getting a little lighter because we're here where the light is. Maybe we should just hang out here for a few minutes. I say that, and then the light seemed to turn off. Do y'all notice that? It just got dark. 
Oh, I think you have to be, like, right there. Well, what we could do is get us some more logs to be able to get that woodworking shop going as soon as possible. Get those three large logs. There's one. Or I think it was six large logs I meant to say. Two. Do we have weight or is it just like... I don't know. I don't think we can put anything in these, but we'll see. We'll try. So, how? what was that again? So we need to find fiber. Uh, go ahead. Oh, I keep forgetting. You have to left click and drop. Yes. Um, four rope, four branches. We have three branches. And a hand planer. Okay. Uh, let's hit I again. Pine branch. We just dropped. So we need to find one more branch on the ground somewhere. Oh, it's so crazy dark. Wait, F. L. Ah! <laughs> My bad, guys. My bad. Uh, pine branch. Um, you're blinking at me. Here I am complaining about the dark, and I just could have hit L for the light. I saw so silly sometimes. I don't think of the easy things. There's a stick. I want branches, though. Uh, boomer, stop it! We also need to be finding us a place to live at the same time. Where is this plant fiber? Is it elusive plant fiber? Like plant fiber in hiding? There's another stick. Sticks for days, guys. Can we turn a stick into a branch? Is that a thing? I don't see anything that even looks like plant fiber. This is going to be like Area Z and... Can you eat it raw? Works great. Okay, well we just found something we can eat. Um, let's left click and use. Oh, can we move some of this stuff down here so we have more inventory space? go in three because that's usually my ammo site anyway. There's, oh, there's some small jars. I wonder if we can fill those up as canteens. Uh, boxes of nails. Some MREs. Maybe it is by weight because uh, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, but we need to find more stuff to eat. We need to find branches. We need to find plant fiber. Uh, we need to get us something to drink. Our water's getting low. It's not too bad right now. Is this one of the houses? Yeah, this is Elizabeth, isn't it? I think that was her name. Elizabeth, do you know where I can find some plant fiber? You guys just, like, chill on your patios all day? Oh, so you can T to trade or E to talk. Oh. Okay, so the other girl, we probably should have moved on so that we could have hit E to talk, because it doesn't count us as meeting her. Uh, Jason? Nope, that was probably Janice. Okay. Why, why do you never want to let me out of this? Oh, refill canteen. Uh, four? Okay, I guess I don't have a canteen to refill. thought maybe I could refill those small jars or something. So, where was that Janice, and what is this? Oh, a snail! We have a snail in our pocket! I thought that was a slug for a minute, and I was going to say, you, Grody. Okay, yeah, we've been here, but I think, wasn't Janice... Oh, I have, like, no sense of direction right now. If you notice my videos, I'm either on point with my directions, like, I know exactly where I'm going, or I have zero sense of direction. So we open you... Oh, yeah, I did. Okay, now we're back at the store. Let's go over this way. Episode 1, How to Walk in Circles. Uh, there's another branch, though, and we need that anyway. Are you plant fiber? You are not. I want to at least get something built this episode, but... Uh, category Resources... I thought maybe we turned pine branches into plant fiber, but I don't think that's the case. Use. Item pine branch cannot be used. Okay, well then, just drop it. 
A little slipper. I'm going to name him Gary. Our snail is going to stay in our pocket. And he's going to be our little friend. And his name is Gary. Oh, oh. Got us some more foods. We are getting crazy thirsty. I hear water. So we should be getting close to water. Oh, water. Okay, can we drink this? Uh, can we, like, grab our small jars and fill them up? I'm telling you, it's like Area Z all over again. We're trying to find stones. We must get in the mind of the plant fibers. If I was the plant fiber, where would I be? I would be everywhere, because that's where plant fibers are, but no. Not so much. I'm going to assume running probably takes more thirst and hunger from you, and we don't have the luxury of... Now, do those give us any water? Also, I keep right-clicking. Let's use. Use. I don't think they give us any water. Okay, well. At least it gives us a little bit of greenery. No luck, guys. No luck. On the plant fiber. I'm going to assume everybody's pretty close to home, so I don't want to wander too far out. We just need to go find Janice and meet her and not try and trade with her. And then meet the other one or two people. Um, would you be surprised if I said I'm lost? I bet you wouldn't. This is Bug Out. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And as always, before I go, remember, when gaming, have fun, play hard, but in real life, be the change you wish to see in the world. This would be a good place to build. <gasps> Mushrooms. A button mushroom. Can I drink this water? No. Hmm. Yeah, I think I want to build right here. Where are we on the map? That's not the map. Uh, I don't think I've seen... I don't even think this is marking us as just the campground. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, I forget you have to walk to get it to go away. Okay, okay. Later, y'all.